here in Tasmania we have uh, this flightless bird called, we call it the native hen or the swamp hen. It usually hangs around swamps and waterways. Uh, it's a beautiful bird. In the 90s uh, found a mother dead on the side of the road and uh, my brother grabbed it actually. He started hen raising it and he handed it to me and I got to really experience a lot of the life of the native hen. It was a, it's an amazing bird. Start with when they're young they just look like a ball of fluff with really long legs. Like a like a normal chicken with legs twice as long as they should be. Because these guys are speed runners. Sometimes we call them turbo chooks, which is another nickname we give native hens. They run really fast. And my kids used to play with this hen and they'd run around the backyard. And it used to run, it pull its wings out and bank as it was running, so it would take corners faster. A fantastic bird, an amazing array of noises they'd make. So there's sort of knocking noise coming from deep in their chest. So like an emu would make. For a long time standing, my favourite bird. They have a nice sort of a bluey grey, and that sort of goes on to a nice sort of a rusty colour. A little bit of a white fleck on the tips of their wings. They have this beautiful yellow beak. It's almost uh, a lime green yellow beak. And then the eye, the eye is like a ruby, it is bright red. In the sun it just shines like a red ruby. A fantastic bird and one that is overlooked because they're fairly common here in Tassie. People tend not to look at them very much or just think this is rubbish. I don't even think they are protected. Probably one of the only native birds which is an endemic to Tasmania which is not protected. Unless this law has changed in the last couple of years and I haven't realised. Uh, but certainly, you know, I would sort of say, yeah, between the tawny frogmouth and the and the uh, native hen, probably my favourite birds. Yeah.